On December 19, 1979, 18-year-old Michelle Martinko was brutally murdered in her parents' car in the West Del Mall parking lot in Cedar Rapids, Iowa. She had been stabbed 29 times in her face, neck, and chest. Michelle had gone to the mall that evening to purchase a new winter coat. When she wasn't home by 2 a.m., her father reported her missing. The police then found the car in the parking lot of a JCPenney. There were no fingerprints at the scene and Michelle hadn't been robbed or sexually assaulted. The brutal nature of the crime seemed very personal to detectives. They followed up on hundreds of leads, but the case went cold for decades. In 2006, while examining the evidence, a cold case detective found unidentified blood believed to be the killer's. A DNA profile extracted from this blood was registered in the national DNA system but yielded no hits. In early 2018, the DNA information was uploaded to a public genealogy platform leading to a familial DNA connection. Later that year, DNA was discreetly gathered from an Iowa resident named Jerry Lynn Burns. It matched the DNA found on Michelle's clothing. Burns was arrested and eventually convicted of first-degree murder in Michelle's death. On August 7, 2020, Jerry was given a life sentence without the possibility of parole.